guys so welcome to the vlog um i guess i'm just about to do a short vlog um me and my mom's about to eat some crab legs and um yeah so i'm gonna do a little mukbang or mukbang whatever you call it of us eating some crab legs and uh yeah so i hope you like the video seeing me eat crab legs kind of for the first time so yeah bye guys so me and my mama are eating crab legs this is my first time ever cracking them. Let me see that tool, Mama. So, we're using like a nutcracker. And here are the crab legs. And there's the mats. There's Mom. Say, hey, Mom. <laughs> she's done, she's done learning how to crack them herself. I gotta figure out somewhere where I can put my phone up so I can do this. Oh, there we go. Keep that, look. There mm -hmm. Look, there's meat down in the in the bottoms. Do you see that? There, there's meat. I'll show you how to get it out of here though. Watch. Mm. Now watch. Oh, you're getting these are on the little part. Oh really? You just break it and piece it and it'll pop right out. Put it right here so you can see. Okay, I'm not really good at this, but I pulled out the little tin and I guess I pulled it I don't know what you call it. Okay. So let's see. Take my little clipper deals. Whoops. This is kind of like having a mukbang. Me and Mama's having a late night mukbang. I don't know if she might have boiled them too, too much because that's probably why they're not cracking good. We got us a little, we're using my, my, um, we call them chopsticks. Chopsticks. <laughs> chopsticks. There's meat all in the tips of this, but. Oh, I see what it is. There's nothing in there. Or it's right in the tip. No one wants to come out of that one. It's just right in the edge. See? Mm -hmm. I'll hold that over there. This is the first time I've ever eaten crab legs, y'all. So, let's see. Let me get this out there. There's meat. It's all right here, but it's falling apart. Thank you. Mm. Mm. Meat. There's not much in that part of them. I think it's mostly in the tips. Don't you? Most of them are like right here in the ends. See? There's meat. Mm. We got butter. Not too butter. <laughs> Mama also has a few ribs and a piece of steak. <laughs> I didn't eat the steak. Oh, no. Well, she's not eating the steak. I ate a bite of ribs. We're just sitting here and eating this messy. Uh, mm. There's a piece. Mm -mm. It's meat that just came out of the this part here. Now watch this. Mm. It's also got the tea. See how it come out? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. So what she was showing me is this. The little the little tip part. Right there. Just break it high. And pull it. Look. And it comes sliding out. There you go. It was, Mm -hmm. I'm going to do another part on the end. 
And then, let me look for a minute. I was throwing them away and she said, and what are you doing? There's no. So is that the only places there's meat at? And mm -hmm. all through it. And there's no. Oh, I got it. Look. Mm hmm. Mm. I got it that time. I figured it out. Mm -hmm. Finally. And then there's me at the, the ends, too. What'd you do that there? Hmm? Pulled it the same way you did the top. You do each each little breaking spot like that. Look. Oh. Getting that one there. Look, okay, so. Look, so you do each little, each little area has a, look, a look. Comes out of every spot. Here, hold on. I'm going to get one. Here. Let me do this one. All right, ready? Here. Here's your tip. You can do it like that, too. There's your other part. Now watch this. Watch. And take that little, little part. There you go. It comes out of here, so there's more in it. I think got stuck. <laughs> is this stuff, um, yeah, if it gets stuck like that, you can push it in the, this is where I gotta, check this. going to that place. Now they eat. No, you didn't go with it. Whoops. Here's my phone. Here in Christian. So yeah, this is that's what we're having for dinner. Like kinda like a muck mukbang. Mom, are you enjoying that? <laughs> She's enjoying it. The finger licking good. <laughs> okay, so let me show you guys one more time how we learned how to weave. How Mama just taught me. How. Look, I just got that out by tearing it off of this. You pull on it. Mmm. Mmm. Here, let me get you one like this, Mama. Look, you take your bottom and you pull the whole thing out. Look at me in the bottom. You get it. That's yours. Okay. So that's why you gotta pull them out of there because there's meat all the way in there. See? I got that. Okay. But I didn't get the next one. Oh. Alright. Let me get this for Mama again. No, I'm not. There's the face. top. Alright. There's that piece. And then these are the, the next piece one. here too. Look, there, oh it came off inside of it. Look, here there's a the little piece right there. I know get this. I got you some more right here though. I'm gonna have to open it to get it out. Some of it comes off. I got meat all over the table. So if it comes off down in it, you have to kinda crack open your Scissors to cut. Mm. Yeah, I got it stuck. Let me get her now. Where's you got another long one? No. I got it now. I was wanting to get you that out, though. There, here's one. 
get her one out of here. Here. There you go. Oh, it's coming shoulders. out of these. I'm getting this out here. Look. Look at all that meat right there. See, this is the bottom. Here, eat that. Christian, eat that. Some. Look at this. Here. Look. Here. There's that meat from the bottom. Christian. Look. Meat from the bottom of it. Mm. Okay, guys. We'll see y'all later. Bye. So this is the end of it. So this is the end of what is left of those crab legs. Me and Mama eat it. Yep. How did you like it, Mom? She said it was really good. So. Okay, guys. So that's it for that one. Uh, all I did was just show y'all our crab legs. Kind of like a crab leg mukbang with Mama. But we was eating too much to talk. So... <laughs> Uh, subscribe to my channel. Bye. Hey guys, welcome to today's vlog. Um, so today I thought I would try a, this is, I've already ripped the top off, but it's a charcoal peel-off mask. Last time I did, um, let's see, last time I did this one that I got in an Ipsy bag. It's a Space Kitten. It's, um, I didn't too much like it. You had to put way too much on to try and get it to work. Um, so this time I'm trying, it's called, um, 7th Heaven, that's the top of it, uh, charcoal peel-off mask. It says cleansing and detoxifying, if you guys can see that. My camera's not focusing. So yeah, it's an easy peel-off mask, so it says, and, um, I wanted to see if it would work good. So, I don't know where I'm going to set this thing at to try and do this because, let's see if I can prop it up right here. <laughs> this is not going to work. But, yeah. Okay, so, If y'all heard anybody cussing, that is my friend Lauren cussing. So, of course she can't watch her mouth. Say hey. Hi. To the vlog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can you squirt some of this in my hand? <laughs> I can't do it. Squirt it in my hand because I can't set my camera down. Yeah, I'm going to. How much? Do, uh, like a handful. Right on the tips of my fingers. Hey, Lauren. Huh? You got to drink that medicine before you leave here. Oh, my God. Tell him I'm doing a thing. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> This is going on my vlog, Todd. <laughs> I do. The world sees this. The world sees you. They ain't seeing me. I'm in here. Yeah, but they can hear you talking about stuff. They ain't seeing me. That's my cousin talking in the background, y'all. That's the crazy. <laughs> That's what you were saying. Our conversation. <laughs> the yeah. like, he said it so They're just joking. He does not smoke crack. <laughs> Here, I need more. Get reactions. You know what I'm saying? It's funny when people react to something you say. They did. Like, oh my god. I don't care, I really don't. You're crazy. I, I, I love having a good time. I'm using my camera for a mirror. <laughs> oh gosh, I got it on my eyebrows this morning. <laughs> I said I'm using my camera for a mirror. Yeah, no, Lauren said something and started laughing. She was laughing at me for saying that. She said something. Oh my lord. I had no idea. Lauren, don't lie. Oh lord. No, no. Now you're starting to sound like Andrew. I'm being paranoid, <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, you are here. Hey, I don't smoke those. Okay, Andrew, so if you're watching this, yeah. <laughs> hey, 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 I don't even miss you on your phone. <laughs> talking shit. Huh? I said, you're talking shit. I don't think, he, I don't think he's on my YouTube. He don't know I got one. <laughs> I don't even have my phone. He doesn't know I have, he doesn't have my YouTube, so. My mom would not let him in the house. I'm telling you right now. I'm gonna call your mom and be like, Mom, can I come over? 450 7119. Call her. There's nothing to hide. Okay. I'm gonna come over and yell. Look at my hand print. Is there no more in it? Okay, I don't know. Put a bunch in. So I can get it from here. Hold on. 
Hey, Mom, you want to drink tonight? It's falling. It's all right. I'll buy her beer. Oh, God. She said you bought your mom's beer. <laughs> you better shut up. That's an alcoholic. I'll buy you some beer. Let me come over here. <laughs> oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, yes, this is what. <laughs> oh, yes, I will. I hate it. I'll do it. I'll swear I'll do it. I swear I'll do it. <laughs> Okay, guys, so I'm going to finish putting this on and let it dry, and I will be back to um, to show you guys when I tear it off. Hopefully, it goes better than the last one, okay? All right, so I'll see you here in a bit. Bye. Hi, guys. Welcome to today's vlog. Um, so, today, I just decided to um, do a vlog um, of me pretty much... Uh, dyeing my hair. I got this color. It is Plum 4 VV. Um, I got it at Sally's, so I'm going to try it and see what color or see how it looks because my um, roots are starting to come back and my camera is acting funny. But um, Yeah, so I decided I'm going to do that. I'm kind of doing like a pampering kind of thing because I have to work again this weekend. I was supposed to be off Saturday and Sunday, but now I have to work because there's nobody else to work. And by the time I get a day off, which will be next Friday, today's Friday, so next Friday, I will have worked 13 days in a row. So yeah, I'm tired. But anyways, I also got some masks. I got this one. This one is Passion Peel Off. Removes unwanted oils and protects easy peel mask. So I got Seventh Heaven. I also have a Honeydew Chamomile Sleeping Mask. I guess you can sleep with it. It's for dry skin. And then I got. Oh, this is bath salts for your bath. So this is not a. Sorry, wrong one. Okay, here it is. It's a 7th Heaven Charcoal Peel-Off Mask. So, I'm going to be trying these and let you guys know how they are. I don't know which one I'm going to use yet. This is for problem skin. I guess for like cleansing and detoxifying easy peel mask. So, which one do we want to try? This one's for combination skin. So, I think... I want to try the, let's do the charcoal, no, let's do the passion pill off, let's do this one, so yeah, um, I'm going to get my stuff done, get my, or get um, my stuff ready, um, I'm going to get my hair color ready to put on, and um, then we'll put this on, and we'll see how that goes, okay, so I'll be right back, bye. Okay guys. So the first step is to put the pre-color treatment on and it says to, alright we've got to put it in our hands and we've got to run it through our hair and put it on our ends. It's like pre-color treatment so it's going to I guess help the color, that light's really bright. But I'll try and block it if I can. Okay. So. And then it says to comb it through the hair. to comb it through the ends so and again this color came from Sally's and all right I've already got my color mixed up and 
I don't know if you guys know this, but um, color, if you um, have a lot of roots out, then the color is automatically going to grab the your natural hair and make it brighter because the other dyed hair it just makes it like a darker but the the hair that is actually new hair is going to be really bright a really bright color so some people like to do the roots first and let it sit on but mine's not grown out too much since the last time I dyed it so Okay guys, hey, um, sorry I had to um, end it a minute ago when I was putting the hair color on. Uh, my aunt messaged and I was needing a mixer, so I had to send my nephew out there to take it to her. But um, as you can see, I have the hair color on now and I have it all over my face because I put a little bit on my eyebrows and it's probably going to look crazy, but yeah. Uh, it, I'm standing outside, it's been raining today and it's cloudy. Not too cute out, but anyways, um, so as soon as he gets back, I'm watching him walk out the yard. I am going to, um, go inside and work on my feet. I want to show you the stuff that I bought for my feet to kind of, I have had such a hard time with, um, like the bottom of my feet being rough and my, you know, my big toes as I'm getting older, my toenails are getting thick. And so I went and got my toenails done another day, so they kind of fixed them a little bit, but I need to shape one of them up a little bit more and um i need to work on the bottom of my feet some and then i'm going to use the peel off mask and here comes the car okay. so yeah i'm going to do that and then when i take this hair color off i'm going to straighten my hair and dry it so you guys can see what it looks like but yeah so that's all i've got right now but i'll be back here in a minute bye okay guys i'm back um yeah look at this I got hair color all over my hand. It's all over, going to be all over the side of my face, on my neck, on my shirt. Yeah, it's all over me. And this is permanent hair color. So once it gets on you, it's hard to get it off. But yeah. Okay, so the stuff I got for the, my feet um, is this Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. It's almond and honey. If you guys can see it without seeing the glare. Yeah. And then, oh, okay, so when I went and got my feet done at this place, um, they used this thing. It looked like a cheese grater on the bottom of our feet, and it just peels the skin right off. I had to go get one of them things, and it's so nice. And see, when you use it, it peels all the dead skin off, and it goes into this little plastic thing. So you pop it off, and you can wash it out, and I love it. I love it. It's just like a cheese grater. <laughs> But yeah, um, so I'm about to work on my toes a little bit and on my feet. And then after I get all that done, um, I'm going to go take my shower and wash my face real good. And then I'll probably do the mask. I don't know if you do. I have to do the mask after I get this out of my hair because there's no way I can do a mask right now and peel it off. So I'll do that next. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do that and I'll be back. Bye.